Hey guys, it's me. Sorry this is such an awkward video, but um, I actually forgot my house key, so I'm kind of just sitting in front of my door, and I was like, hey, let's film a video. So, this is what I normally wear. Something like that. Anyways, ugh, I'm so tired. <laughs> uh, shh. Uh, a while back, I said I was going to make a video about my opinions on equality and stuff like that. So, I think I may talk about that now, if I can. Um, my mom's coming to rescue me. Because she's coming home from work. Anyways, but um, I just have a few things I want to open up your guys' minds to, I guess. I don't know. This may be a very awkward video for me, as well as a lot of other people. Because... I don't know. I know a lot of people don't like my opinion on things, so I often don't just put them out there. But I was like, hey, this is my YouTube channel. I can do what I want. So, um, equality. Based off sexes, based off relationships, um, based off religion, I guess. Um, let's start with religion. And I understand a lot of you guys will probably have a problem with this part, so I'm sorry. But, um... Me, myself, I am not religious. I don't believe in any upper being or anything like that. And one day when I was in Salvation Army, uh, someone came up to me and told me that I was offending them for the way I looked and that I offended them f because of the way I dressed and how I have slurs on my clothing and all this stuff. And it made me really think. I was, I thought about it and I said... Who, like, who are you to judge... Well, I didn't actually say this. I just kind of thanked them and walked away. I was like, thank you, and I walked away because I didn't want to be rude because being rude isn't going to help any situation. But I thought about it later, and I discovered, like, who are you to tell me what to wear and what I can have on my body and what I can tell, like... <sighs> how your first opinion of me should be. If you don't like the way I look, then you shouldn't approach me. You shouldn't be rude to me, that's for damn sure. You should just ignore. You should just smile at me and walk away. Or, in fact, you don't even have to smile. You can stare at me and walk away for all I care. But it's not fair for people who look different for them to be judged on what they wear and for them to be seem to be put as a lower standard than those who are normal or I don't know seem different uh and this kind of leads on to the whole religion thing because I've actually been called a satanist and I've been called satan's whore and uh I've been called a devil worshipper and all this stuff and I'm Honestly, not. Like, I don't believe in anything. I am... I don't know. I don't believe in anything other than this. But apparently, if I were... Like, say if I were to be a Satanist or... Uh, I don't know. A Mormon. I don't, I don't know any religion. Why do people need to criticize people based on their religion? It's their own decision to be what they want to be. I don't have to be Christian. I don't have to be Mormon. I don't have to be a Satanist. I don't have to be anything. I can choose who I want to be. It's a, that's, why, that's why my parents live in Canada. That's why I live in Canada. Because I don't have to be pressured into being one thing. Like, I can be whatever I want to be. Because um, I've actually had a few... Like, I, I went to a church once... But, I went to a church once because uh, both my grandmothers and my grandmas uh, go to a church and they sing and they're in the choir. So I go there to support them because, you know, that's what family does. Um, and I had a lady approach me and, like, I wasn't even dressed ridiculously. Like, I was wearing a pair of red plaid pants and a nice button-up black shirt. Like, I wasn't being revealing or anything. But, um... They just, they gave me the dirtiest look. And I was like, like, what is your problem? I don't know. Maybe it's because they hadn't seen anything like me before. But it's not like I'm that abstract, honestly. Um, and then more on to relationships. I totally approve gay rights. And my phone case as well. But you guys haven't seen that. Um, or you might have. Ooh. But um, 
I totally support gay rights. I think gay people are awesome for standing up to who they want to be. I think lesbians are awesome. I think gay people are awesome. I think people that support gay rights are awesome. Um, I think it should be free love for everyone. I think everyone should have some love in their life, whether it's family, whether it's friends, whether it's a pet, whether... Oh, sorry, I have, like, a string on my pants, and it's really starting to bother me. There we go. Okay. Um, whether, like, anything. You have to love something in your life to have that appeal to yourself. Um, no one's gonna love you if you don't love something in return. Um... I don't, I don't know, like, I see these people who are on Instagram or something, and they're like, you're such a faggot, or, um, gay fag, blah, 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 some, like, really harsh slurs, and me, myself, I'm not a lesbian, but I have dated a woman before, and it was nice, I liked it, I just, it wasn't for me, um, and I just... I feel so hurt when people say rude things to other people about who they love. They can't help that. Um, they, this is going to get real awkward real fast, but they came out of the womb wanting to, they, they want to love. That's, that's human's nature is to love things. Human's nature is to like things. Human's nature is to pleasure things. Human's nature is to support things. It's like, People can't bat well, they can, obviously, but they shouldn't bash you based on who you like, what you like doing, anything like that. And if they do, they're wrong. Anyone that tells you that you're wrong for liking someone or for liking something that you do is wrong. <laughs> Downright, hands down, you are right for liking what you like. Whether it's males, whether it's this, whether it's like the same sex, whether it's the opposite sex, whether it's playing hockey and you look like me, whether it's you like drawing or you like sitting on the roof, it doesn't matter. You like what you like and that's good. Um, I just, people are so self-conceited that they don't realize how much they're hurting people by telling them that they're not allowed to like what they like. I find that ridiculous and I find that harsh and I think that like, really? Where's that getting you? That's not getting you anywhere. Like, there's that church, here, I'll put the name here, um, that Baptist church, who stands outside with signs that says, God hates fags, and stuff like that. And it's like, who the fuck do you think you are? I'm sorry, but, like, that made me so angry. And I was so proud, because there was this five-year-old girl who made a lemonade stand across the way, and she raised money for love and peace. And I'm like, girl... <laughs> I wish I was you when I was younger. I wish I, instead of just having lemonade stands because I wanted a few extra bucks to go to Johnny Z's the arcade. Like, really? Oh, gosh. Such an inspiration. Um, yeah, I'm just, like, I'm trying to say you can love who you want to love. And then on to sexes. I know some people may get offended about my opinion on this because I actually have quite a lot to say about this situation. Um, women get paid less in every work job than men do. It's just fact. And I don't believe that's fair. And I'm not, I'm not saying that women deserve more money, but I'm saying that women and male, if they are on the same level, if they have the exact same job, they should get paid the exact same amount. It's not fair for women to be paid less where men get to pay more. I don't like, this isn't the 1800s anymore. Seriously, there's supposed to be equality. There's supposed to be rights. There's supposed to be... Just, it's so frustrating to me, because... And I hate to, like, play a pity party, but me, myself, as a woman, as a female, I want to have the same lifestyle as a male does. I want to be able to own my own house. I want to be able to work knowing I'm getting the same paycheck as the person next to me if we have the exact same job why should I be paying get paid less I don't think it's fair I think it's harsh and I think it's rude um another thing is and I know some people will be like yeah this is okay but um I think it is absolutely ridiculous hi 
It's my neighbor. Uh, I think it's absolutely ridiculous that the males can walk around basically with no clothing on, and as soon as a woman shows her shoulders or shows her kneecaps, she's known as provocative. I'm sorry, I can't, it's not my fault I have boobs on my chest and an ass. <laughs> like, we, that's the way females are made. Why shouldn't we be allowed to wear a short skirt once in a while and just have fun? Why shouldn't we be allowed to show our shoulders or wear a crop top without this constant fear in our head that people are judging us and calling us sluts? Like, oh my gosh, men can walk around with no shirt on and they don't get second looked at. Mm, I'm sorry, I don't see any equality there. That's ridiculous. And I'm not saying I want to walk around with no shirt on, but I'm saying I want to be able to wear short s skirts and shorts and not have people stare at me and be like, oh, she must sleep with men all the time or women or she must work for someone. No. No. I like to dress the way I dress. In fact, um, I usually wear fishnets underneath my shorts. And my shorts aren't super short, because I'm not into super short, short short shorts. But I still get stared at. I don't... Apparently fishnets are known as a naughty thing, and you're not allowed to wear them in public. I'm sorry, it's... I can wear what I want. I can... I just... I find it ridiculous that men can get away with so much. And I'm not saying that... I'm not bashing men. And I'm not saying that women are so much better or anything. But I'm saying it's ridiculous that just because we have boobs and we have a butt that we are not allowed to wear short clothing. It's like if you see a man walking down the street wearing a dress. I don't see anything wrong with that. I think that's fucking cool. I think that men who dress the way they want to dress, I'm like, bro, bro, did I really just say that? You just, you do that. You kick it. You kick ass the way you want to. You dress the way you want to. You can wear a skirt. You can wear a kilt. You can wear a dress. You can you can wear a spaghetti strap, tank top, for all I care. I say that's cool. I say that's A-OK. -okay. Nope. People will judge him. People will look at him and be like, hey, you're not wearing jeans and an Aeropostal t-shirt or something. It's like, excuse me? Really? I don't know. I find that ridiculous. So I guess that's just some of my views on equality and how I find it ridiculous. Um, I have a lot more, but this video would be like over 20 minutes long, and I honestly don't feel like filming a 20 minute long video, and plus my mom will be home soon, and I have to study, so... But I hope for all those who are interested in my opinions and my thoughts do care. And I hope that you guys might share your opinions down below on this conversation or this topic. And if you can add on to anything that I said or add anything remotely, at, just put it down there. Because I, I want to know what you guys are thinking as well. Because some days I feel like... I'm one of the only ones, even though I know I'm not, but some days I'm like, really? Okay. Like, I'll try and explain something to someone, and they'll just roll their eyes at me. So, I hope you guys like this video, and I hope you guys like my opinion. If you didn't, I'm really not sorry, and I'm not trying to come off cocky, but I'm not sorry for my opinion. Um, I was raised a certain way, and I believe in equality for all. So... I hope you guys had a good week, and until next video, over and out.